Hey everybody, it's Laser Friday, getting ready for the weekend in Israel, mid-December, beautiful summer weather. Just wanted to tell everybody happy holiday season. Don't forget the holiday season's about love and forgiveness, rebirth, seeing that inner light. And uh, it's, you know, don't, I don't have to tell you all, everyone knows not to get, it's not about shopping. Don't get caught up all in the shopping, keeping up with the Joneses. If you reach out to just one or two people in your inner circle that maybe you haven't spoken to in a while, it could be a family member, it could be a friend, it could be a, a cousin, it could be a, a sibling, it could be your parents, you know, it's about forgiveness. If you wanna give a real present to the world, just fix one, one scenario in your inner circle, swallow your pride and try again. Just think about it, for every minute you spend shopping, spend at least two minutes thinking about how to heal and give new confidence to maybe some of those people that uh, you didn't treat properly during the year. And um, that's what it's all about, go back into no judgment and thinking about the unity of the world and thinking about what we can improve with ourselves of having that rebirth, having that inner silence, the humility, and um, not giving up on ourselves. So again, it's laser mid-December in Israel. I'm sending you blessings from Israel. So blessed to be here and um, I'll see you soon all over the world on tour. Thanks for all the support for the music and just keep on smiling and just, you know, don't get caught up in what the world gets caught up in because the world is, on a general mass level, is never going after the truth. But you could be going right now after the truth, which is going after your own inner being. You know, don't get caught in the arguments or thinking. I heard a beautiful teaching today that there was, maybe about 2,500 years ago, there was this, um, really holy person that he got it a little bit mixed up it's a it's one of the traditions from india where they don't believe in the concept of god and this one leader he says why doesn't he believe in concept of god because he says as soon as someone believes in god they take all they want to give up responsibility that it's everything's from god it doesn't happen from me and he said everything comes from you to really be spiritual to know that every second whatever happens is coming from you but you don't have to give up on the concept of God. You know, in Israel, we have the mystical tradition. The Baal Shem Tov said, using the changing of the words in Hebrew, we have a saying, it says, Ladat shakol mamala mimcha. Ladat akol mimala mimcha. If you, there's one way to translate it, that's to know what is above you. But he translated it, this holy master who was very much into God, but he was very much into changing the definition of what God is. He was saying there is nothing else but God and don't argue about what it is or isn't because no one knows. It just is and it's you too and it can't be separated. But he said, know that everything that's coming down in the physical world, it's from you. You have to take responsibility for it. That's, that is the real spiritual God thing. There's no conflict between taking responsibility and saying, yes, it's all God. There's millions of explanations and definitions how you say, is there, is there divine providence, is there choice, is there no free choice? It doesn't matter, just you have to know that wherever you are in the world, whatever your situation is, yes, you are responsible. You decided it to be that way and you have to take the plan. You have to make the decision that you wanna change. First, start fixing the world by changing yourself. Take responsibility, make slow, persistent practice each day of learning how to go into your inner being. Then you will be overcoming the world. Then you will be able to connect all the paths of the deep truth, saying they're all one, and then it will be a true holiday season. I love you all. And again, blessings from Israel. So blessed to have this beautiful 72 degree weather day to clean the porch and hopefully soon to send you more music from the porch and um i'm always here for all of you so anyone who's feeling a little bit pressured some anxiety feeling down in the holiday season been on the road long enough had my roller coaster rides long enough to know what that's about you can all continue to write me and i will as everyone knows eventually get back to you love you all happy holidays